what's going on guys welcome back to another video with ad fishing today we're going fishing down the shore some saltwater fishing we're going out to the wrecks hopefully get on some summer flounder hopefully we can get on some keepers and i can do a catch and cook video for you guys but with that being said i'll be filming on the gopro today i just broke my hero 8 so i'm going to be filming on the hero session which is my backup and secondary gopro so I don't know how good the videos will turn out, but I'll try to make them as good as possible for you guys. It is currently 6 a.m. Our ride is going to be here soon. I'll see you guys down at the marina when we get on the boat. You guys stay tuned. It's going to be a great day. All right, guys, we made it to the marina where we will be fishing. It is low tide currently. Um, we're getting bait now. So hopefully we get a, get out in the water soon and hook into some fish. But with that being said, you guys stay tuned and uh, I'll give you an update when we're at our first spot. We landed at the first spot here. How deep is it, George? We're at the rack right now. I just hit bottom right there. Check my drag. Oh, this is nice having the bait caster. I'm using my Corrado DC, guys. There's something floating right there. Water. Corrado DC at the St. Croix. My granddad's using, um,. What a loot, loot, Shimano, he's using the SLX DC, I actually recommended to him, with the lose, lose rod. So, we're fishing for summer flounder here. What's the weight of these, five ounces, six ounces? Five ounce um, tap dancer with some gulp and... Some minnows. Granddad's hooked up with a fish here. I think it's a big one. I have no idea. This is weird. This is very, very weird. She says, she says it's weird. Waiting for it to come up. Oh man, this is freaking. I'm changing rods. Don't like that? Rollins having a hard time pulling this up, whatever it is. Yeah, it looks like it. And he's foul. Look at the big, big He caught a skate. So, put the net away. Drop my bait back down there. I knew that was a duck bait. Duck bait, right? Finally hit the bottom right there, guys. That skate is on top of the water. Having a hard time swimming. Yeah, see this 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 rod ain't the way, man. If I tore it up too big, I wouldn't be able to get it. It's still got the the drag. But um but yeah, I'll let you I'll let you guys know yeah, if we catch anything. A few moments later. I got something guys. I said I'm gonna go get this. This is something good. This is something real, real good. I'm gonna take my time with it. It's coming up. Oh, it's fighting, it's fighting, it's fighting. I'm not going to give it any slack here, guys. He's got to get the net. Here. Oh, this is something good. It's something good, guys. I hope. I don't think it's a skate. It feels like a fish. I hope it ain't a skate. It's super heavy. Oh, yeah, it's fighting. I don't think it's a skate. See the shake? Yeah. When you get close, don't bring it out of the water. Just right. keep it in the water. Keep I it think right it's there. coming up. Right there. That's it. Right there. Here it comes. Is it? Yeah. Oh, it's a skate, guys. Yeah. These darn that's a, that's a big skate, too. All right, guys, but we're going to get this thing off the hook. and yeah, i got to get it. Something big. Fish, Granddad. Something big. I don't know if it's... It, oh, my... 
hooked on something here, but it, it, it's coming in here. Alright, please don't be a skate. Oh. That's a friggin', let me see what that is. A sea robin. I caught a sea robin thing, yeah, I guys. Gotta, I gotta walk. a different species, that's good. And you snagged them in. Well, I snagged them on accident, guys. So, it is a fish, though. Weird looking fish. Yes, it just, it just popped it. Oh, oh that's a flounder. Bring him in there, George. Bring him. Good job, George. Here, get him in the boat. Good job, George. George, the captain of the boat, hooked up on a flounder. We don't know how long it is. It's a nice, nice flounder. You think it's a keeper, George? Oh, yeah. He thinks it's a keeper. They, they're pretty positive it's a keeper, guys. There you go, George. You need to get over here. How how was my net job? Good, perfect, beautiful net job. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Bit me too. He bit you? Yeah. He's got something in his mouth. How much is 19. he? 19 inch flounder guys, so he's a keeper. We're gonna try to get some some more. So you guys stay tuned. I, I hope, I hope it's not no skate. Yeah, this is a fish. This is definitely a fish. I hope. I don't want to be. Yeah, this is a fish. Net, net, net. Straight up. Don't keep moving all around. All right. This is a fish. That's a flounder. Another keeper. Let's go, baby. Jeez. All right, guys. I think I just hooked up with my first keeper of the year. George just got his. Whew. Green gold, granddad. <laughs> guys, you don't know how good that feels. Hopefully. You think you guys think he's a keeper, right? Yep. he's heavy. You got to give me line. It looks like 18, 19. 18 and a half. 18 and a half keeper, baby. Give me, uh, I need my needle. I gotta go. Okay. All right, guys. We're gonna keep fishing here. Granddad's the next one to get one. Did anybody mark any of them spots yet? <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna see you guys in a bit. We're gonna keep fishing. Awesome. Let's go. All right, guys. Our flounders are flipping around in there. Anyone tick it? Yep. All right, we ticked it. What'd you catch yours on, George? Green. Green goat, tap dancer. Caught mine on the same thing. Yeah. Good fish, good fish. Good fish. I think it's a flounder. Yeah, it's a flounder. 
Just a little sh short. Shorty flounder. There we go. Good job, George. Netting. Caught a little flounder here, guys. There we hooked. And he's off. Oh, that was what? Did you take that one, George? All right, we got five. We got five. Five, five flounders. Five flounders. So we're going to keep fishing here, guys. All right, guys, I thought I'd give you a quick update quick. Um... We just caught a bunch of skates, so we're gonna move spots. We have two keepers in the boat, one 19 inch and one 18 and a half. We have six flounders in total. The other four being shorts and two being keepers. But we're gonna move back and start a new drift and um, yeah. So you guys stay tuned for that. We're gonna do a lot more fishing, so you guys stay tuned. My line's getting close to the motor. No, it's a flounder. Got him. Alright, another flounder right there, guys. I'll take it, George. Seven. Got seven flounders, guys. So, I'll let you know if we catch anything else. Good fish. Good fish. Yeah, I got a flounder. I don't think so. Got a flounder here, guys. Nice old flounder. Fourteen incher. He gone. Nice. We're hooked up, guys. Angelo, hit that says word that says Mark on my GPS. Mark. Mark. Oh yeah, I hit Mark. Alright. Get your net ready here. Where's the I think Granddad has the net here? Yeah. 
screw it in tight too, make sure it's screwed in. Yeah. Okay. All right. We're all kinds of hooked up. I marked two of them. Let me mark yours on the counter, George. All right, guys. We just caught three, three flounders. We are at 11 now. So we're gonna keep fishing. Let you know if we catch anything else. You guys stay tuned. Good fish. Good fish. <laughs> Now it's kind of feeling like a skate. Oh, I think it's a fish. I think it's a fish. Yeah, it's a fish. It's a fish. It's a fish. Good fish. Good fish. Good fish, George. Can't see yet. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Not a good fish. Man, with that top Any tap. Fish. That top tap dancer makes it feel like it's so much heavier, though. Oh, there's another. Another flounder there, guys. Another one for me right there. So. Excited about that. Alright. Alright, let's get this. Off the hook. Right there, guys. Another old flounder. Boom, baby. Let's go. How much is that, George? 12? 12 fish? Alright, guys. I'm going to get rigged back up. You guys stay tuned. Don't move your pole around so much. Uh, this is like something good. Keep changing directions, like I don't spin it right out. Right, here we go. You got one? Yeah. Get in the boat, boy. Oh, spit it. Here we go, guys, another flounder right there. No, I mean, like, this is the best one I felt all day. Yeah. Here, pull it over. Does he look 18? He don't look 18, does he? He felt good. He's right in the boat. Oh, got him. Okay? Yeah. Let me slide by. Good job. You guys like that. Caught another flounder here, guys. Sorry. 16. Granddad's hooked up here. I got off. You seen him? Yeah, I see him. I saw him. What was it? Flounder, I'm pretty sure. Big flounder, yeah. Oh, he's too small. Alright, 
guys we're heading in but this is what we were using today it's a little tangled up but you're we using a tap dancer gulp and some minnows um, I was using my Corrado DC with the st. Croix rod um, but we're gonna head in so I'll see you guys back at the marina so you guys stay tuned all right guys we just got in from fishing today as you guys saw we caught two keepers I caught one and George caught another and we caught a bunch of shorts as well and a bunch of skates but uh, my granddad is filleting the flounders right now I'm not gonna show you guys that because I don't want to get demonetized for YouTube because you know how they get with that type of stuff but we're gonna fillet these flounders and we're gonna do a catch and cook so I'll see you guys back at the house when we cook them. You guys stay tuned. All right, guys, we're back at the house. We got the flounder all filleted. My grandma is about to cook it up for us right here. So I'm gonna show you that to you guys. All right, guys, my grandma is getting the flounder all breaded up here. So she's putting it in, this is flour, right? Flour. Okay, so she's putting in flour, then she's putting in the egg wash, okay? I guess she's getting that all soaked up, all the cooking stuff, you guys know. And then, and then she's crumbs. putting it in this breadcrumbs. This is Italian breadcrumbs or fish Italian fry. Breadcrumbs. Italian breadcrumbs right there. And so putting it in the frying pan. Putting it in the frying pan. We got four beautiful fillets. My granddad hooked us up one with right the fillets. First one's going in the pan. Oh, look at that sizzle right there. Man, this flounder is looking good. It was a great day out there on the water today, guys. But um, I'm going to let the rest of the flounder get in the pan. And I'll see you guys when I take the first bite. You guys stay tuned. All right, guys. We're going to go take a view of our beautiful flounder. Oh, my grandma's been, been cooked up. What do you got? Two plays in there right now? Yes. Yeah. Look at that. Beautiful flounder cooking in there. You're doing it a little bit different today. You're doing it with Italian breadcrumbs instead of fish fry, which I've had it before, guys. It is really, really good. My grandma makes it really good. So I was super excited for that flounder today. So we're gonna we're gonna start eating soon. You guys stay tuned. All right, guys. I got my fish right there. Just a little piece to start off. I'm going to take a piece with no sauce on it. No, nothing. Just a piece of flounder right here. Wow. Delicio. That is amazing. Doesn't need any sauce or anything. I do like ketchup and cocktail sauce in mine. But... I'm going to end this video here, guys. I hope you like this this different kind of video, catch and cook, and like the saltwater fishing today. Caught a keeper, two keepers, and some other fish, so hope you guys like that. I appreciate you watching. Make sure to comment, hit the like button, and uh, subscribe so you can see more awesome content like this. And I'll see you guys in the next one.